नमस्ते एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल शक्ति योगा विद शैली लेट्स योगा टूगेदर बिगिनिंग और प्रैक्टिस इन समस्थिति स्टैंडिंग टॉल विद क्लोज आईज कनेक्टिंग विद आर ब्रैथ Inhale raise your left arm up stretch it to the right Exhale back inhale right arm up stretch exhale back So warming up with side stretches inhale we stretch up exhale we come out of it Deep breath in stretch exhale you come out of it It's always a good idea to start your yoga practice with gentle stretches especially to the sides. We hardly get to stretch the sides throughout the day. So let's do it in our yoga practice. Now your feet are slightly apart, arms straight in front of you. Exhale to your left. Inhale center, you exhale to the right. Your arms are straight. as you move the opposite elbow bends twisting from the waist a gentle twist at the beginning of the practice keep breathing through your nostrils inhale to the center exhale to your sides a few more you're doing nice arms down next move inhale arms up interlock the fingers the inner arm will touch the ears and we are going to draw big circles the movement is going to come from the waist you inhale you go up as you go down you exhale nicely done now circle anti clockwise this one is really good to lose the fat in the belly at your own pace arms down take a few relaxing breaths and when you are ready take a deep breath in arms up exhale all the way down to uttanasana With the first two fingers of our hands we are going to hold on to our big toes. Yeah, and we will do sit-ups. Let's strengthen our thighs and our knees. Inhale, you come up, exhale, bend your knees. Sink your breath with your movement. Inhale up, exhale, bend the knees. Relax. in uttanasana and from here we are going to come down onto our mats the back is straight lift your feet off the mat your feet and knees are together arms are straight nakasan boot pose inhale and you stretch back exhale boot pose I call it inhale wide boat exhale boat. We'll do a couple of these. We are not going all the way down. The shoulders remain off the mat and you pull yourself up using your core muscles. Coming out of it. And from here drop your knees to the sides soles of the feet are together. You can either rest your hands on your legs or you can slide them from under your legs and stretch them out your head resting on the feet and breathe coming out of it and getting ready for the next move table top position oh yeah got to do that Okay, table top position. From here, we are going to 
stretch the right leg behind us and lift the left hand off the mat staying strong hold the pose not your breath keep breathing on your all fours now switch the side left leg and right arm off the mat keep breathing through your nostrils on your all fours one more time and slide back to balasan from child's pose we are going to come up into tabletop position and down to tucking our chin to the mat let's do it a couple of times so inhale you come up exhale you go down chin on the mat but focus on the arms position here the elbows are pointing out and not back as you come down elbows pointing out chin on the mat inhale up exhale down inhale tabletop exhale tuck the chin to the mat inhale up exhale down elbows pointing out that's nice child's pose to tucking the chin to the mat take the tabletop position one more time and from here we are going to step up with our right foot the right leg is straight you can be on your fingertips or if it is available palms on the mat back is straight look ahead and breathe through your nostrils good stretch for your hamstrings glutes even for the ankles from here we will take high lunge position inhale and you take your arms up to the ceiling palms together gazing up to the ceiling good hold coming out of it hands back on the mat step back into downward facing dog Take your right leg up with an inhalation as you exhale bend the knee. Inhale right leg up, exhale a knee to right elbow. Inhale leg up, exhale knee to left elbow. Inhale up, exhale. Stepping up and high lunge one more time. Inhale arms up. Hands together and we twist to the left breathing deep staying strong in the pose coming out of it hands back on the mat stepping back and we are in the plank position we will hold the plank keep your core engaged knees gently on the mat and slide back to child's pose and one more time we will do a child's pose to tucking the chin to the mat you know the rhythm you inhale tabletop exhale come down tabletop with inhalation exhale down child's pose inhale tabletop exhale down make sure that you point your knees out pointing them back is going to put unnecessary strain on the shoulders choose your speed and keep breathing deep all right table top position one more time this time we step up with the left leg the left leg is straight the hand position is completely your choice you can either have your fingertips on the mat or your palm pressed on the mat either way you are getting a good stretch and for some of us having the foot planted on the mat might not be available that's okay you can lift your toes all right coming to the high lunge position once stable you take your arms up on the inhalation bring the palms together and breathe 
exhale hands down on the mat step back to downward facing dog inhale we take the left leg up exhale bend the knee bring it between the arms inhale up exhale knee to left elbow inhale up knee to right elbow inhale up and you step up with the left foot high lunge position one more time inhale arms up hands together in prayer position and we twist to the right keep breathing deep coming out of it hands back on the mat stepping back with the left foot plank position holding the plank one more time falkasan body in one straight line gently coming out of it knees on the mat taking a deep breath in deep breath out and getting yourself ready for the next move come on to your knees hips and knees in one straight line stretch your right leg out left hand goes down right arm is stretched to the opposite side and when you feel stable lift your right leg off the mat breathe coming out of it and moving to gate pose right hand on right leg left arm stretched up neutral position and let's take it to the other side stretch the left leg out deep breath in right hand down left arm stretched up and you lift the left leg off the mat stay strong coming out of it gate pose on the other side left hand sliding down on the left leg right arm is stretched up coming out of it sit in vajrasan and we will wrap up the practice with a breathing technique bellows breath make a fist inhale arms up exhale you bend your elbows close to your body we will do 3 rounds with 10 breaths in each round forceful inhalation forceful exhalation let's get ready for the second round bend elbows close to the body and make fist with your hands inhale up exhale down 3 4 5 Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. Get back to normal breathing before you begin with the third round. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, and relax. Stay here for a few minutes with your eyes closed, and soak in the goodness of the practice. You can either have your hands with palms facing up, or you can have your hands one on top of the other with left on top of right. I hope you enjoyed the practice as much as I did and that you will join me again soon. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel Shakti Yoga with Shelly.